I'm with Mr. Fred Van Zijl from the Department of Water Affairs in, in, in South Africa. Can I zoom, zoom in? You show zoom in on your card, please. And please tell us what function you you're in. My function at the moment, I've got three hats on. The first one, I'm acting chief director of water services. That means a whole complete set of uh, water to the people. On basic services to the total effective services, including infrastructure, service delivery and sustainable management. That's water quality, financial management. So that's my official job. But I've also got the task now to uh, re revise and assess the African Timbersi's total water management and manage the new water strategy for South Africa for how to make really an impact on effective management, uh, the A to Z of water management in South Africa. So what are you right now very passionate about in your work? My passion is that South Africa is a water scarce country and we've reached uh, the equilibrium of the water balance of the fresh water. We are close to using all fresh water. So in the past we've got this whole thing about working on infrastructure, building dams, which we had to do, uh, and focus on technical issues. But we've reached the era to go into smart water management. And smart means we have to think about the bigger picture about systems management, getting people involved, getting ownership, getting improved governance, better planning, uh, better regulation, new technology. Because we, we cannot use the old ways of just thinking we bought a dam and there's water. We've, we've beyond that point. So the strategy which we are working on is this a participatory management approach in South Africa, getting all the people involved in, in, in uh, own and, and comply to business. Uh, that's one big issue. It's not just a national department's function. The second one is to get into uh, viable and sustainable management, uh, which includes financial management, uh, asset management, and so what do we call it? We stretch the water. We go to water scarce country, we have to stretch the water. We, we don't have enough funding, so we have to stretch our money. And we don't have enough infrastructure, so we have to stretch the infrastructure to do more. And in this whole business is about management. It, it, the focus is more on moving away from infrastructure to management and better governance. And one important part of that is intergovernmental governance between ministries and between programs like environment. If we have new mines, we need that economic growth and development, so we support the countries for growth and jobs. And is the, is the water ministry effective in, the, in the talking with the other ministers, ministries in South Africa? Well, I think it was, a, let's call it, it did happen, was not effective enough. So the whole focus now of how we get together, not only talk and plan together, but also regulate together, because if there's pollution, there's a minister of the environment, the minister of energy, the minister of minerals and water affairs, and we have to start working together. So the whole focus now, how we sort out our roles and work together, to, to have an improved governance system. But in the end, what's my real passion is implementation strategy. We can talk and have all these nice ideas and concepts with us and make it happen, how we get the real action. So the strategy I'm responsible for is an action-oriented strategy with key deliverables on water quality, on services quality, on uh, funding and uh, asset management, real targets with the sectors to make it happen. Mr. Vidal, thanks very much.